are going to hi friends we are going to start the um very interesting topic today uh, which is on eye health how you can take care of your uh, uh, eye health or enhance your vision and naturally so these are some of the eye health hacks uh, you know you need to know for uh, uh, natural way of even healing or taking care of your of your eyes so we'll be discussing about um, a few things for example what are the food you need to have which enhances your vision second is uh, you know the supplements what you uh, can have or which helps you to naturally boost off your um, you know eye um, eye health or vision and then we'll also discuss about some of the ancient uh, indian techniques um, and processes or procedures or methods which is which is well known to people since ages uh, you know to uh, take care of your eyes okay so we'll discuss about those um, so without much further ado so let me get started about why you know uh, okay so let me okay so that's the wrong one okay let's go to that so then we'll discuss about why do you need or what happens to your eyes okay so that means uh you know uh, what causes your eyes to degenerate and uh, to have on all the eye issues and uh, you know hopefully once you know about these uh, then you can you can take care of the, uh, the things as well around it okay or the quill cause of these so now first thing is uh, you know hours in front of the screen so that means the ultraviolet ray which comes out of uh, you know um, all your electronic gadgets so those are quite uh, you know dangerous that means uh, uh, you know if you are you're an it consultant uh, or you work in front of a computer for a long duration of time you will be exposed to our uv rays from uh, you know from the um, monitor okay your laptop or uh, you know for the if you are spending a lot of time in front of uh, your phone so that means your phone it also emits those uh, you know uh, uv rays uh, which is uh, you know uh, not good for your eyes so that means over a longer duration of time once you expose your eyes to all these uh, the, these rays so that causes uh, you know your eyes to degenerate <clears throat> so um so that is about uh, you know one of those uh, you know reasons uh, and uh, second we'll discuss uh, you know about is um, exposure to uv rays uh, you know we we discussed about uh, that as well uv rays uh, you know it comes from not only uh, from from your computer screen or monitor and uh, your uh, your mobile mobile phone screen but it also comes from the sunlight itself okay so that means if you are um, out and about as well and uh, you are in such a such a country or such an area where uh, you know the you are exposed to this ultraviolet ray from the sun then that also causes your um, eyes to you know um, degenerate or you know it it will it may later on uh, over a period of time it may cause you know eye issues as well okay so now next is a pollution okay so pollution is uh, out uh, you know when uh, probably you, unless you are in kind of a country area or a village uh, you are bound to be exposed uh, you know um, with uh, pollution okay so that is uh, always pollution in and around us okay so if you are in city then you are exposed to high pollution and pollutions uh, are nothing but it caused uh, it may be a dust pollution maybe uh, you know your um, carbon pollution that means uh, you know the vehicles uh, around you uh, even if uh, you know you are uh, you know all electric cars are around as well you are still exposed to the pollution uh, you know uh, from emitting from you know industries all around uh, us as well um, so it is what it is uh, kind of uh, unstoppable okay so and uh, so when you are you are exposed to the pollution and your eyes also are exposed 
as well to the to the to the pollution and that causes eye issues as well okay um so then is uh, poor dietary habits so that means uh, if you are not eating healthy diets which are uh, kind of a you know like um, uh, fruits and vegetables or uh, you know raw f- fruits and vegetables unprocessed uh, you know fruits and vegetables n- nuts and legumes and so those kind of uh, you know healthy diet if you are not on and you are eating all this highly processed food to uh, and already processed to you are processing it yourself uh, and eating it so barely any nutrient is uh, left in that food what you are having and uh, lack of this nutrition to your body uh, also causes m- many issues in your body and uh, you know the eye issue is one amongst them okay so now let's discuss about uh, okay you now know about uh, all that causes uh, you know the, your um, eye issues you know uh, may not be you know you may be quite young now but uh, you know it may happen or issues may come up later on in your life uh, but uh, it is well known fact that it it does happen okay eye issues so then let's talk, um, discuss about uh, the impacts okay that means when you are talking about eye issues what are the issues so how our eyes uh, health is impacted and what uh, you know these um, uh, different causes what we discussed earlier um, so what does it lead what do they lead to okay the first is um, cataract so cataract is kind of if you if you uh, if you see um, you know as soon as you know someone you know as as you start to to age cataract is a very well known you know kind of uh, you know issues all around people have cataract you know aging people or mid age or um, to to bit, bit older people have cataract as a you know eye issue okay so that is very very important for all of us to take care of uh, you know that as well but uh, cataract usually you know you go to um, go to a, a surgeon you know uh, and uh, you know usually usually through laser eye surgery they take it out but why do we need to have cataract to start with why what causes the cataract now you know today okay second is a molecule um, sorry macular degeneration that means uh, you know degeneration of uh, you know um, i think it's kind of a layer on on, uh, on top of your eyes you know which is exposed to the, to the air and uh, you know so macular degeneration uh, it also you know it's it rapidly is caused by all these uh, you know factors we discussed about like pollution like ultraviolet ray or sp- time spent on uh, you know in front of the, the laptops and uh, computer or electronic as gadgets so these also you know they uh, cause macular degeneration and then is dry eyes okay so now dry eyes are uh, uh, you know uh, something which is uh, you know usually it happens uh, yeah so dry eyes usually you know uh, is uh, quite common uh, you know with all, in the, in the society you, you may have seen people having having you know uh, dry eye problem and also the other way around as well some people also have teary eyes you know like they you know have these issues of always uh, you know the the eyes are uh, full of tears and uh, you know full of water uh, that also happens because of uh, you know bad eye health okay? so if that is the case then how do we naturally take care of it so we are discussing about natural we are not talking about uh, you know the medication or procedures what you need to do naturally are we able to take care of our eyes absolutely because why is that so or why should we need to take care of our issues health issues uh, you know naturally instead of uh, relying on you know all these medicines because we are built you know by our creator to heal ourselves okay uh, look at any other animal they don't have any doctors okay so what they do is uh, you know the god or the creator has given them okay the the knowledge 
about uh, you know their own body and what can heal so that means you have seen hopefully if you observe other animals you have might have seen birds eating few, you know a few kind of herbs and uh, you know um you know picking on uh, you know few of the leaves um you must have seen uh, you know like stray stray dogs or you know certain animals also you know uh, you know they go and eat a certain uh, kind of uh, leaves and uh, you know uh, birds and all those things so those are kind of inbuilt so that means our creator has given that knowledge to these animals okay but somehow we have lost it okay over the years because we are now you know, relying on all these medicines but if you see the nature has if nature has given us a problem it has also given this solution to us and solutions are nothing but these natural remedies okay so let's discuss about the food okay how you can take care of our eye health with giving our body that nutrition what it uh, body is already lacking for our eyes which our body needs for our eyes um you know and what kind of a food which we can eat so that it can take care of our uh, eye health so first is leafy greens that means spinach kale and kale uh, and broccoli okay now that means this deep green uh, vegetables okay spinach deep green uh, kale is deep green broccoli is deep green so what happens there is that they have inherent properties or uh, you know all these uh, green uh, leafy vegetables so they have that uh, you know properties um, of uh, uh, you know lutein so they have lutein they have uh, you know a, a substance called uh, you know zeaxanthin antioxidant so that protects um, you know um, our eyes against uh, you know the ma macular degeneration okay so now that's about the leafy greens okay now let's move on to another kind of a superfood you could say it's carrots okay so along with uh, you know the green leafy uh, vegetables what we shared earlier carrots uh, you know if you haven't already uh, you are not aware of then uh, you would know that carrots are rich in beta carotenes and what beta carotene does it beta carotene converts into vitamin a okay and what is vitamin a vitamin a is an essential nutrient for maintaining the retina health preventing night blindness okay so that is how you know a carrot you know gives beta carotene a beta carotene to vitamin a and how beta vitamin a takes care of our overall eye health okay the second is a fatty fish okay or rather the third one is fatty fish so that means uh, you know uh, fatty fish like uh, uh, salmon uh, mackerel sardines uh, you know so these are fatty fish that means they have uh, you know a quite a bit of omega-3 in it and that omega-3 helps us with our eye health as well okay omega-3 fatty acids and it definitely helps to you know um, alleviate the risk of macular degeneration now let's move on to citrus fruits okay now citrus fruits are another um, natural food which has uh, you know a fantastic you know amazing good qualities for our eyes okay oranges grapefruits uh, lemons they are full of vitamin c and also these uh, you know citrus fruits they strengthen uh, our eyes and reduce the risk of cataract okay so now let's move on to the next food which is um, also something which is very well known to take care of our health and well-being is nuts and seeds okay so nuts and seeds like almond walnut flaxseed so these are very much well known okay to have the qualities and uh, you know the nutrition to take care of our eyes okay so now let's move on to another food which is eggs okay 
eggs also have you know very good qualities okay uh, to take care of our health so this is a 